is uh, Cheers to My Eyes, but it's really from the cold weather in Harley Cry. So, um, you guys have a blast out there today. I cannot wait for you to see this course. It is amazing. Just a quick thing. It's freezing here. It's in the 20s. The high for this race, if I finish it around 12, is 34. The field likes us to be somewhere between the 16s and the 27s this whole race. I'm in shorts. Bacon, two layers. It's gonna be a fun race. It should be fun. We'll see. Hope you have plenty of videos. I just hope it don't freeze. Mark and set, go! Yeah, here goes nothing. My little training run. Start the old watch. And my watch is off. And here we go. There's mom, dad, and Kristen, and her parents. goes. Right now I just want to stay warm. Stables. <laughs> and if they'd let me borrow a horse, I don't know. Actually, let me a little chilly. right now. Making me look bad. Oh well. Three miles down. Many more years to come. Here's some wind cheers on.
I feel like she's jumping to keep warm, honestly. Oh well. Nice little incline done. <laughs> there we go. Switch me, I'll get you. Yeah. <laughs> the guy that just was on the film on this thing, he's running a 50 mile in six days. So, uh, <laughs> He's in 350Ks and he's his only second marathon, like similar to me, only just uh, don't have a 50 miler, <laughs> thankfully. Anyway, if you do this. Well, if you want to break me off at a six mile segment, it's a little bit at the end still, but a decent little breakdown, you end up with me getting it there in 56 minutes for the first six, so. Not too shabby. Give it a few months and this will be a really a whole heck of flowers. Right now though it's uh, obviously not growing but so much. And over here is what they call the bass pond. Well, this is the bamboo. There's a better view of it. The waterfall at the Bass Pond. Come to the horses to visit. They're going the wrong way. He was a little ways back according to the sign. Watch it. wind is cutting like a knife to hot butter. It is merciless. It's not too bad at the well it's blowing bad but the temperatures warmed up ever so slightly. So it's not quite as powerful. But boy it's chilly. I can the house ain't that old and I'll tell you about the looks of it now. It 
it is, it's got a lot of work that's been done to it. Huh. Nice zigzag you have all of us. They got the emergency career in case we freeze to death. But golly. And if you can see it, yes, it's slightly snowing at the moment. It's been doing it on and off throughout the day. Uh, it's cold. Since my nice little pit stop at mile, right up at mile 11, basically, it's been good sailing since then. that have passed me, or I should say the ones that passed me I was in the bathroom, catching them slowly one by one. Nice pond. Come up here, I think for, I'll have to get a video clip on get closer for Gratton's sake, because I think it's the vineyard coming up ahead. We're getting close to it at least. I think in the pond, as I promised earlier, it's the vineyard. They look a little bare at the moment. <laughs> oh well. I would grow out of there right now. It's freezing out here. Oh goody, it's still coming up. It's been a little while since we've had one. Been enjoying the downhills for the last bit. Like I said, I've been quite fun though. Since the bathroom, like I said, I've been able to find the next little group ahead, reel them down, and pick them off. Well, it's fun in, your, in my own way. We'll see how my legs will look to the end, but just past mile 16, according to their markers. Nice view. Ah, coming up with another fun spot called Dam Hill. I'm interested to see if it's kind of like the Dalfus race with Blue Suck Falls. One can only see it the fun way. I'm closing in on mile 19 now. We're on the second loop of this inner loop thing. I think it's interesting though, on these hills, all I can say is Wednesday nights pays off because I know you're wrong, my legs don't exactly feel like the best on the block. They're starting to get a little sore obviously, but so far a lot of these people have been walking these uphills and so far I have been eating them up on the uphills. So uh, <laughs> not surprised but I mean, like, this is what the hill is talking about. I'll have to show the damn hill. The damn hill is a little steep, but it's really short. So anyway, like I said, it's up to the next water stop up there, I believe. So, we're plugging away. Oh, it's been pretty interesting so far. The last six are going to be flat as a pancake, though. All right, here oh, we go. We're going to go up the damn hill this time. With it on. And you can see my point. Well, yes, it's a little steep at this last hill in. It ain't squat compared to the usual. See what hangs right up here? That's the end of the hill. Like I said, the last hill gets steep. That's about it. I think you're getting the downhill again. Here comes my 20, so it says them. My watch is closer to 20.5. I'm not actually 20.4, but again, I don't know if they said the garments didn't quite go right, but that's a heck of a gap. 314, almost 315 call it. The kind of question is, can I pull off a 10 can an hour at this point? I don't know, honestly. It's kind of asking a lot at the moment. That, and my stomach's telling me to wheel in to the Johnny house again. Or an orange tree, whichever you'd like to refer to them as. Find out the fun way, I guess. We'll cross the bridge in a bit, and then we'll be on the home stretch, more or less. 10k home stretch, call it what you want. Thank you. Here's the bridge that you can't get. 
there is some rabbit thing over here that I have no clue in God's green earth what it is. He was standing on top earlier. I don't know what he is. Back to the horses. Right now I'm up for a ride. He's up for a because man, I don't know if you can see him from here, but up there in the purple, we are on the purple and the guy in the orange is the pace group. It's the 415 pace group, supposedly. He's supposed to average a nine, nine mile. I swear, he has caught everybody out here and passed him in the last bit. Not one soul has passed this man. Not me. I've caught and passed you know, everyone he's got, and I cannot make any ground on him. In fact, he's still pulling away, and it's killing me. I am trying. This is just not happening. I'm catching everything else but him. I guess that's not such a bad thing, but man, these last 10K is essentially a flat as a pink out and back, and boy, it is pushing for what I really care to do at this point. Because I basically just got to the halfway of it, I think. It's hard to tell with the way the miles are. No, 23 is right up ahead. Oh, well, yeah. Unless Slick up here can't do a 3.2 miles, he's almost got 40 or 35 minutes to do it in. That should be pretty easy for him to he's going. Oh well. We're getting there. Just starting to kind of hurt. To say the least. Oh well. We'll be back later. Well, the wind's howling in the face. A mile and two tenths to go. So says they. I watch it disagree, but oh well. 415 pace guy behind me. Damn, I'm quite happy with that. And right now, I am freezing. Most part, I'm tired of being freezing. Cold out here the whole dang day. And I am bringing down any and everyone in front of me that I can get to. Between here in the line. Last few miles, heck, since I've passing, I've been killing myself. And it's now getting close. I've learned it. <laughs> Sample goo chomps. You can't get in them without a knife. I tried to rip them open with the teeth. My hands can't do squatting yet. Or is this are frozen. But I can't get into anything. Anyway, back to the finish line. I'm hammering it down as best I can. Well, what was wrong with the finish line was that. It moves it kind of. This is where we started. I didn't get mad. From Seattle, Washington, Craig Sunker. Nothing. Congratulations. Well, successful day. 4 11 something. Well, what was my goal this time? I wish I said it took the last 10k easy, but <laughs> wow, what a day. It was a heck of a finish. Since I went to the bathroom, I don't think hardly a soul passed me. Anyone that did, I found them and caught them back. So I had fun in that regard. It was fun catching folks a lot. So much for this race, though. Whew, well, that's over at this point. I'm done.